Hey guys, thank you very much for checking out this video. This video is on how to FTP to your site and just FTP in general. So if you don't really know about it, this can be a really useful trick actually. Okay then, uh before I start with with the tutorial, excuse me. Uh I'm a bit tired, but before I get on with the tutorial, I'll just make a little quick shout out to my old friend and partner Rival Tech. He was once my partner. His account got his account got hacked, and I he wanted me to make a little shout out, so that's what I'm doing. Um, he bought me a .co.uk domain uh, name for my site, so that's pretty generous of him, and I think he deserves this. And yeah, he's just a great guy. Check him out and subscribe if you want. Okay then, let's get on to the tutorial, dudes. Just oh, actually, the most used FTP client that I've come across is FileZilla. But first of all, I want to explain you what FTP is. FTP is a way; it stands for File Transfer Protocol, and it's a way to transfer files to your site uh, instead of going to the site, logging in, and just select the file, upload file, wait for it to finish and all of that stuff. This is a way easier thing to do. Just open a little program, choose the site you want to connect to. If you're connected now, just choose the files you want to upload and done. So the most used application that I know of or used client is FileZilla. I mean, I thought it was a web browser before because of the Zilla, but yeah. Just double click it here and you'll be you can download it. There'll be a link in the description. Okay, so FileZilla basically has a very simple interface. Here it has the process going to the connection, the files and the f uh, the folders and the files inside the folders. And here you have a little quick connect. But I prefer connecting to my site so I can save it and just quickly transfer or quickly connect. So I go on file and site manager. Here I have a bunch of different sites that I actually use for my uh, I actually use to upload files to. This works for UCAUSE, this works for all those it works for OOO web host. It works for the premium users of free webs and basically all other not free hosts. But let me just go here inside UCAUSE you can go to your control panel and there's this FTP details button just click it and you have all the information you need to fill out this thing okay so what I do is I click new site and inside here I'll just call this video site but I'll just quickly remove this because I've already this is my second no fifth attempt on this so have all the information already done so you need your host in, insert your something it's actually very different for a lot of different well it's different for every single host mine on ucause it's your control panel login dot ucause dot com your site basically and on logon type choose account the user name that was provided in the FTP details the password and the account is the same as the user. For UCAUSE, I do not really know about the other uh, hosts. I mean, I don't really pay for that stuff. But okay, let's just click connect. And you'll have all these good stuff. No red, as we can see. And you're in here. These are the files that you have. And these can be used for pictures and other stuff like that. So in here we're just going to navigate to my desktop and my favorite little folder here. No. And then I'll go on Photoshop. I, I will upload April Contest. It is connecting and as you can see it's uploading here. And it's a pretty big file so it takes a bit of time. But it's faster than the other clients, and, in, and you'll have it in the successful transfers. I can also make a video on how to directly upload your files using Dreamweaver. Another thing I forgot to tell you is FTP is basically how to put, or hosts, sorry, is basically putting your 
website files on there but anyway this is more for a bit experienced website creators something useful to say but now you just transferred something to your FTP and if I'm not wrong now we can exit files and then go into the file manager in the file manager we can you have all the different files that you actually uploaded already and I uploaded April contest dot jpeg and select it and go on view and we'll see if it's there so here on ucause it would be something ff comp help ff dot code uk slash april contest dot jpeg and that is how it works you just uploaded it and you can and you have a link to it so people can actually uh, zoom in save image as and call it whatever they want so that's actually how you put files on your site using FTP and FTP is really simple guys thank you very much for watching this video uh, if you liked it we rated five stars if you didn't rate one star uh, please subscribe to my videos it will help me a lot so thank you very much for watching